Fucked up my garlic running up I thought my social worker to just fuck up My name's Anita Anita, I did I had a real shit week And a real shit weekend, yeah Anita, I hit, I say This is Anita. Anita hit. Yeah. So, uh, yeah, just to give you a little update, it's been a pretty shitty year so far. Uh, I forgot to get a calendar this year, but I can pretty much keep track of what time of year it is by what kind of chocolate they're selling at the dollar store. And so, uh, well, you know, New Year's was shitty as usual. And uh, I made some New Year's resolutions, so, uh, you know, I decided to improve my health. So, I switched to uh, natural cigarettes. They're additive-free. And uh, also fair trade coffee and uh, organic mac and cheese. Except, you know, that stuff's pretty expensive, so I get the rest of my food at the dollar store now. But, you know, at least the cigarettes are good for me. Tastes like shit, but anyway. So, yeah, so I had a crappy new year, and then uh, I, had a, I had a shitty St. Patrick's Day. I, I went out to the parade, but I, I didn't watch the parade. I just went out to collect some bottles. And then after I got a bunch of bottles, I went over to the liquor store to cash them in. But there was a big lineup because it was St. Patrick's Day. And so while I was waiting in the line... I took a shot of Jack from the sample stand and uh, well I'd had a few shots before I got there and uh, I kind of lost my balance and I fell into the the pyramid of beer cases and I knocked them over right into the sample stand and I knocked over their bottle of Jack and uh, they got really mad at me and they, they wanted to kick me out and I told them well, did it ever occur to you that if you didn't want people knocking shit over in here, you shouldn't be handing out shots of Jack? But they kicked me out of the store anyway. And they wouldn't take my bottles either. Fuckers. And so then the next one was Easter. And I went over to my sister Joanna's place to see her and her kids. And I, I brought some Easter eggs for the kids as a surprise. And I dyed them at home myself. And uh, so I brought them over and I said, Hey kids, who wants Easter eggs for breakfast? And they were all like, me, you know. And so I got the eggs out. And then I boiled them. And uh, oh, when I boiled them, all the paint came off. And the kids were really upset. And they said I'd ruined their Easter Sunday. Yeah. So I guess next year I'll boil the eggs first and then dye them. Yeah. And, uh, and so that's it so far. It's been a pretty shitty year and uh, we'll see how Mother's Day goes. And that's it. Yeah. Yeah.